Hey, welcome to the channel. In this video, I'm going to show you how to kill the bone mass in just over seven minutes. If you're not sure how we got here, I've got a prep video that will help you get to this point. Here's a quick recap of what we brought. Let's go. Level two iron helmet, level two troll hide cape, level two scale mail, and level two iron greaves. Level two huntsman bow, 200 frost arrows, level two iron sword, and level two banded shield. Carrot soup, sausages, and cooked meat. Poison resist, minor stamina, and medium healing mead. You need 10 withered bones to summon the bone mass. The most important part here, you have to be rested. 100% stamina regen. Let's go. Make sure you start right on where the bone mass spawns. This is a quick way to take about 5% of his damage. Uh, you're going to get hit initially by his poison like I did here, uh, but I still think it's worth it to get in there and get those quick swipes uh, and then back on out. From there, it's really just going to be a bow game. The frost arrows absolutely slap him. You want to make sure you're always maintaining that crowd control on these blobs here to my right. So we'll come over, kill those real quick. They'll also pop uh, some skeletons from time to time. Just take out the ads as soon as possible so you don't get behind. Give him some space. I'm always trying to just kind of kite away and just keep laying into him. So you can see there, my bow is level 29, uh, if you're curious. So I, I try to get headshots in here. That's a 48. There you go. So I, I feel like hitting him in the head is actually hitting him for more. Activate the power of Ikther. This is just going to help uh, with your movement. You're going to save stamina, uh, running, and jumping. So I'm not really sure. This is the new update on the bone mass, and it's supposed to be a harder fight, but he kind of just keeps pathing in circles. I did a couple of these fights just to see if he would do the same pathing. This is actually the second time I fought him. The first time I attempted a, a melee run, and it just didn't seem to be the best move for this guy. These frost arrows just absolutely slap it. So you can see, I mean, we're already about 25% down. Uh, we're just going to be entering about two minutes into this fight. Um, the whole goal here, we have to kill him by the time our rested buff goes out, or you'll see your stamina does not regen fast enough to be able to stay on top of him and the ads. It's raining, so you're wet the whole time. Your hit points don't recover as quickly. So getting that rested buff and killing him within that time frame is what you have to do. The bone mass only has three attacks, right? So he's got the poison, which he'll drop around him. He puts his head down and just looks like he's barfing, right? And that puts poison all around him. I'm gonna get caught in it right here. There it goes. So that's an easy one. Just stay away from him and you won't get hit by it. He also throws a blob of poison at you. I think it, you will not be hit by this, right? It is not accurate. It's really timed by him. And then the other one is a swipe he does if you get too close. So if you continue kiting, killing these ads you're gonna be just fine there was a swipe again i got too close um so just keep moving back right kite around the corner here you go i'm gonna clear these ads out i've got my stamina meat on now and you can see my stamina regen is much better so i got swiped by the boss and hit into the ads so i just took a medium healing pot there just to keep my hit points up on top of him you do not want to get behind in this fight the poisons will kill you. Make sure you keep pulling your bow back all the way so you get the full damage out of each hit. And it makes your frost arrows worth more. Uh, you're going to see here in a second too, this is his big AOE he puts around him, pukes down and blows it around him. Again, easy to stay back. I was just on the edge of it there. Uh, you just keep moving back, doing little half circles around him and keep firing into him. All right, so we're about five minutes into this fight. There's uh, six minutes left on our rested buff and the bone mass is under halfway. So the timing is looking really good. Uh, you just got to keep the pressure up. I'm just going to say it one more time. This is the new boss update where the bone mass was supposedly supposed to be harder, uh, but they, they messed up the pathing. I never fought him before, so I'm not sure, but him walking back and forth like this, I mean, this is fish in a barrel here, people. So you should be able to pull this off. Go get your frost arrows and you can make this happen solo, no problem. You can see there, he's just throwing the blobs into the trees. Uh, and we're gonna just put the finishing touch on him here. 
couple more and done. All right, so three minutes, 50 seconds left on Arrested Buff. So, you know, just over seven minutes and you're able to solo the Bone Mass. You can now head back and hang up the Bone Mass trophy head. The Bone Mass Forsaken power will give you resistance to blunt, slash, and pierce. When you equip the Wishbone, it'll help you find buried treasure and also silver veins in the mountains. Hey, thanks for watching the video today. Next up is the Modder. So please like and subscribe and we'll see you next time. Thank you.